It is on this summer in Mississippi, and as always, it's important to remember how to keep yourself safe from heat-related illnesses. Indeed it is, and WJTV 12's Griffin Hardy spoke with the doctor at UMMC today for tips on how to protect yourself from the summer heat. According to the EPA, more than 9,000 Americans have died of heat-related illnesses between 1979 and 2014. In Mississippi, we are by no means immune to the hazard of excessive heat during the summer months. The heat index, a measure of what the temperature feels like when the humidity is factored in, can easily reach over 100 degrees on summer afternoons in Mississippi, as it did earlier today in Jackson. One of the most common mistakes that people make is, uh, is they start out in the heat in a little bit of a dehydrated state. So it's really important to be hydrated before you actually get in the heat. Our elderly population is more prone to the impacts of heat related illnesses than other demographics of the population. They don't tend to uh, be able to dissipate the heat correctly or, or the way that a um, different age population would. Uh, patients with chronic diseases don't tend to handle the heat as well. So if you begin to feel abnormal at all when you're in the heat, the best uh, advice is to immediately get into a cooler area, try to cool yourself down with um, you know, cold towels, uh, wet rags. Reporting in Jackson, meteorologist Griffin Hardy, WJTV 12.